What is going on, everybody? Welcome to the new Seasons 2.0. Title update is here. Everything we've been waiting for that we've been talking about with TU22, Division 2 is now live. It came out today. Um, I'm off work, just finished hitting the gym. Let's jump right in and get first impressions here of me trying the new season. So I haven't seen many videos of it, uh, of other content creators playing. I'm gonna about to jump right in and see it for myself. So yeah, I don't know if I'm going to end up posting this or not. I don't know if this is the style of video that you guys are looking for, but there's going to be the more formal build videos and stuff coming for sure. I've got so many that I'm excited to try. I don't even know where to start, but now I'm just going to record my first impressions, see what's up. Okay, so it seems like we have Theo Parnell. So he, I guess, is our target for the manhunt. Scout one activities completed. But I guess you get little hints on activities to do, and then as you complete them, you unlock this section, and then these will unlock over time as the season progresses. Um, and that's how we do the manhunt. So there's there's like two things going on. There's like the manhunt going on, which over here, which our target is Theo Parnell, and then. What I'm curious also to see, so that's stuff that we can go towards. And then we also have the shades of red. Here we go. Ooh, this is our new season track. Okay. There's a premium and a premium plus. So I guess if you don't buy, you only get... What does this look like? Thousand... Okay, so this is okay. So here's the season pass. Um, I'm not really understanding. Like for me, it doesn't seem clear what each is because they have this premium and premium plus thing. I'd imagine that, of course, if you don't pay for any of this, you just get the free items as you progress through. So instead of having like the two tracks that we had before which I think was super, super clear. Now it's all kind of one track, but things are dispersed. So sometimes you won't get anything on the free track, right? And then you'll get this um, for free. But I guess so this is if you're premium. And then ultimate is maybe if you have premium plus. Ooh, that's, that's really hot. Damn. Yeah, so maybe if you buy Premium Plus, you get these Ultimate ones. But if you have Premium, you don't get them. I, I'm not sure how that works. That's really nice. Yeah, I'm not sure. I'm not sure if I'm going to get... Uh... I'm not sure if I'm going to pay for the season pass. I don't usually. Uh, I used to before, but I don't play as much and don't care as much for the like cosmetics. And I've been full on caches for so long since I've started uh, doing like uh, watch mules on my other character. So I don't know. I don't know. Honestly, I'm happy with what they're doing with the game. I like that they're, I mean, it's a pretty old game and they're still putting effort into developing and trying to do some new things. So this is a, a situation where I, if I was interested, you know, money aside, I wouldn't mind paying the money to support the devs, support the game, you know, that's a, that, that I don't really have a problem with. I just don't know if I like you know, money aside, we'll even find value from what's offered in some of these, uh, the premium things. I, I just don't care for it that much anymore. I want, of course, the gear. I like making builds. That's why, that's what keeps me coming back to this game, is making builds and new play styles, new ways to play the content, you know? So that's where the stray go. And the, yeah, those are kind of lame. And the Centurion Scabbard are going to be the most interesting for me. So, 
That's our season pass. And to level up in this, what I don't like as the type of player I am is that to level up, what you need to do is go through these journeys. So you get XP from going through the journeys. Uh, why do the people have a little plus 10%? I don't know why. Then you have priority objectives as well, which will give you um, XP, resources, E credits. Interesting. I could do XP. I have no rerolls. And then, of course, we also get timelines here. Three times XP event. Okay. So that's ongoing right now, so we get triple XP, that's sweet. More than double XP, that's a good way to start the season. Then we have some global events. Five X XP event. Damn, they're really bringing the XP, jeez. Well, I, I like to see that, that's great. Um, and then we'll go through, you know, our journey. Alright, we need to do six of these things. This will be easy. That's one. I'll do the missions. Two, three. That's easy. Four, five, six. I probably won't do the. Or I could do the prop broadcast. Control point. I'll see if I end up using the pulse skill. I probably will when I do some build testing. And then we'll go from there. So those are the two things we have. Alright, so those are two things we have going on here. We have the manhunt where we have activities that it seems like we need to figure out and then uh, go do them. And that'll progress our mana towards the story element of the season. And then in terms of the rewards track, that's over here. And to progress that, whereas it used to be just regular XP from levels, we have like set uh, what they call the journey missions that have set objectives, kind of like a global event, I guess. The, the whole thing kind of just feels like a global event as a whole it's just a bigger version of it that's kind of ongoing throughout the season and so we have some objectives that you need to do and then you'll level up that which will give you this anything that has this orange with that symbol that's xp that's going to go towards here your season track all right well i already have this built on Oh boy, let's see what they did to the poor Scorpio. Reload time, two seconds. How much worse is it going to feel? Ooh. The reload is slower. The reload is slower, and you feel that. You feel that, that's for sure. Um, and then in the end, it's taking... What I think it was one extra shot to proc poison, one extra shot to proc disorient. Shock, I think, is the same. It might have been, it might be one extra as well. And then this, I think, is two extra before you get the max stack, which is unfortunate. But I don't think it's that bad. I feel like the 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 reload that hurts. This used to have a really snappy reload, and that's one of the reasons why it was so effective as a shotgun. You know, it's a mag fed shotgun, tight reload speed. That was pretty sweet. So, okay. You know, I'm not going to go get into the builds right away. Let's, uh... Let's do Aaron Space Museum. Let's just jump right into a mission. So, Sorbio got changed. Striker backpack got changed, but we're not using the backpack here. Um, so, this should perform really well. And then we have this global modifier. Swapping mods, hostile modifiers. I can And I can opt out. Um, the enemy within medium range will stacks will acquittal very sad. Selected back to you. Yeah, 
Damn. This will reflect it back. This will make them take less damage. Feels movement speed. It confuses you. That sucks. Uh oh. Okay, so you know what? You know what I'm gonna do? Let's put this on heroic. Um, let's match make it, because why not? Um, we have the seasonal modifier system on. You have received an invite to another agent's group. Uh, let's join. If they already started, I'm gonna leave. I might leave it. Seems like these guys are silent and repurposing anything they yeah, can. Yeah, I'm gonna leave. The crafty bastards. I'll give them that. I wanna, I wanna host it and run it myself. Priority objective available, agent. Tag anything useful, announce okay, I'm gonna run a heroic. Um. The shit out of anything too dangerous. Another agent is now in your group. Where do you, you see? Is group. it okay over here? Blank. Global modifier. No active modifiers. Okay, I haven't unlocked anything in the modifier section. Um, I'm not going to... This is what we're going to do. I'm not going to read anything about the hostile modifiers and the symbols. Um, I'm just going to play and try to brute force it. And we're going to see how bad I get spanked. <laughs> because I have no idea what those symbols mean. The reload's a, the reload's longer. You know, we have handling on this build from strikers as well. I'm getting good frames. I wonder if they optimized. Wow. I shredded that guy. Now from what I understand. The point blank, the like base seasonal modifier will just basically make you do more damage when you're further. Nothing new, nothing too crazy there. Um, these guys all have this this symbol on it, and I don't know what it means. We need to figure out what they're doing here. See if you can find any intel on their operation. It seems like these guys are salvaging and repurposing anything they can from this place. Interesting. The crafty bastards. I'll give them that. So they've all seemed to have that symbol. You know what? Let's let's look at what it means. So I've seen them all with this thing, Master of None. It's big enemies that are equipped with the incendiary ammo in short range and shock ammo while in long range. Ooh. Okay, that's interesting. Um, those are definitely two annoying ammo types. But, uh, yeah, if you kill them fast Tag enough, uh, I, mean, I haven't even noticed. Later. These guys have a different one. Let's brute forth it. <laughs> Let's just kill them, or at least try to, and then we'll learn about what that actually means after. Ooh, that reload is tough. It's not snappy. Ooh. No, that's tough. Oh, I got trophies from that. That's cool. Another swap here. I feel like they... Oh, that's a lot of people. 
I think they reduced the reloads. Oh my goodness, I'm getting shredded. Ooh. I'm shredding myself. Ah, I see. Okay, okay, okay. Up there. Keep moving. Ah, Still got two up there. So that must be. Oops. They had this one. Requital. Shoot an enemy within medium range, build stacks of requital. For every stack, a portion of the damage dealt will be reflected back to you. So that's why I accidentally, you know, because I wasn't paying attention at all, engaged at leader. medium range. And then that damage, and then I was destroying myself. I shredded my own armor, and I have a lot of armor. Huh. Mm, shooting enemy from a different range zone resets the stacks. Huh. So that's interesting. Another agent is now in your group. And I think I need to loot stuff. We got a full stack now. Focus on my journey. Loot Military pieces of gear. Okay. This is certainly interesting. But so far, I don't seem to need to worry about um, the one that gives me special ammo. Oh, that's right. We have fully automatic rifles now. That's very fun. The medium range does seem to be pretty, like a short range is pretty tight, so I don't think I need to worry too much about that. But yeah, requital could have killed me for sure. You know, this is nice. This is why we have that assault rifle on the build as well. So these guys are in medium range. Should have given me. Can I track this? There you go. That should have given me loot. I can track this. Okay. Oh, it tracks the whole journey, whole mission. Okay, that's kind of cool. Oh, it didn't count as looting gear? That's annoying. If we back up, we should end up getting them into that further zone. These guys have requital though. So I'm gonna push. Requital, basically, you just can't engage them in medium. So I'm at two loot. If I pick this up, I'm at three. If I pick this up, I'm at four. And that's at five. I think you need to go in and out and also loot them. You can't loot them as trash. An exotic cash. Oh, and it looks different too. That's nice. Look at that fancy little thing. 
I jump this? Oh yeah, we're here. Oops. Oh, that's a new one. I don't know what that one is. How am I still in medium? I feel like this is going to be really powerful with my like rifle build and my smooth operator build in legendary because those ones are made for engaging from distance. Ooh, detox. I want that. Sit. Wait, loot pieces are good. How is it still at five? Dude, that's so weird. Oh, I just crushed the... Oh, that's so awkward. I'm so used to crushing everything. Maybe weapons don't count as loot pieces of gear. Now we're in the range distance. That's what's up. What's six? Okay. That's a gun. If I loot it, it doesn't do anything. If I loot that, also doesn't do anything. Okay. Agent, so it does have to be gear, from what it sounds like. What is that chance? I need to make sure. I need to watch out what I'm crushing. Because some of this stuff might actually be useful with the new patch. Shredding everything, that's amazing. God, this wine is fucking good. So this is gear. That's six. If I looted this junk. Ah, it counts. Okay, cool. I don't have a lot of room and I don't want to be picking up that stuff. This guy's backpack is cool. Setting a recovery team. Oh, it wasn't his backpack, it's his look at that. Components Ooh. identified. Suggested use. Missile construction. They can rig it with a warhead if you need to push. You wouldn't need any guidance system to hit the White House or a settlement. Kinda goes without saying. If you see any missiles lying around, make sure they can never ever be used. Huh. I don't think I need either of these. Database patch indicates designation LMR90. That would be the missile then. Please neutralize that fucking thing by any means necessary. We're getting a fair amount of kills. Salvage crew just ran into those reinforcements. They need backup. I think this is our last stage. Let's keep them in the distance. Ooh, I don't know what that thing does. We killed them anyway, so it doesn't matter. Yeah, I'm gonna rush. Yeah, I think it was good because he had requital, and I think my teammates were getting railed by this guy. Because they were he was reflecting damage with those requital stacks. True Sons Munitions Factory is out nice. of action and they lost a big stockpile of ordnance. Throw in the fact that the settlements can scavenge those workbenches and tools, and I'd say it's been a pretty I think good that's day. a lot of XP. GG's to everybody. Let's go. Hardware components. Loot these as trash. I don't need that. Okay. GG's. GG's. That felt really easy for Heroic, man. This thing is going to be powerful. 